Hey guys, it's Brynn with Backward Prints. Today I wanna to talk about how I got started with my business. It's a question that comes up a lot with from my customers, and I'd love to share the story with you guys, hopefully to inspire you to pursue your own dreams and or passions. So about almost nine years ago, I started Backward Prints. I had just graduated college. I went to CU Boulder. Go Buffs. Um, and I found myself being, you know, a little frustrated. I just graduated school, just trying to find a job, and I was looking up jobs, especially to become an artist. And I was a fine artist, so it was a little bit challenging to find a job, especially uh, graphic design. Uh, didn't really have a lot of experience, and most jobs required that, of course, you have to have about eight years of experience or, you know, something crazy like that. And you're like, oh my God. Uh, come on, I just graduated from college and I don't have any experience. Um, but yeah, so I graduated and I was going through some of my sketchbooks and I saw all these really cool designs and I thought this is kind of a shame that these designs are just in these sketchbooks which are on my bookshelf and no one's seeing these. So I decided uh, after going through them one day that I would start Backward Prints and start an eco-friendly stationary line. Super random, but at the time, I knew, like I felt it in my gut, I knew that it was what I wanted to do, and I just trusted that feeling, and I let my heart guide me to basically, you know, inch by inch, just trying to find out what that next move was. So uh, at the time, I was in Colorado. I had moved back to California, um, which is my hometown of Laguna Beach, and which is a beautiful art community. I am so blessed to be here, and we, this town just flourishes as an art town. So I was in a good place to start my art business, and I started, and I really didn't know what I was doing. I was completely lost, but to be honest, I just dove in, and that's one of the questions I do get a lot, you know, like, like I know I want to be an artist, Bryn. I know this is what I want. This is what I love. I'm in a job I hate. Um, like, how do you how do you start? Like, where do you begin? And I would say, literally, you just start, it, even if you think you're not ready. Like, because you're never gonna be ready. So, definitely, most important advice I could give to you is just, just, just go. Like, it's kind of like the standing along the edge analogy. You just you got to do it or like maybe jumping out of an airplane you don't want to but you know you have to and just that initial jump is really scary but then it's really exciting so exciting so that would be one of my main tips of advice and then um, so then you just start and then honestly for me what was cool is that I started doing these art shows in Laguna and the customers, people that I was meeting, they were giving me the most amazing feedback and they were requesting, you know, different for me to make different designs or different uh, products. And at the time I just had like five card designs. So I'd go home like that following week and I'd make, you know, like a bunch of different designs based off what people were requesting. And then I would do another art show and then people would say like, you know, do you have a penguin or a robot or something, something? And I'd be like, uh, not at the moment, but it's coming soon. Um, so I kind of basically just like literally rolled from the seat of my pants. I, I just inch by inch, I just kind of did a little bit each, each week. And before I knew it, I, you know, about one year in, I had a nice solid collection of, of, of goods to sell um, at these art shows. And I was actually making really good money uh, for being a new artist and not really knowing what I was doing. So anyways, that's my advice today for you. I hope that helps you. Feel free to ask me any questions in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, definitely thumbs up it and subscribe to my channel. Uh, this is very new for me. I just got started on YouTube. So uh, anything you have questions about being an artist, especially um, and um, tips or advice I could offer you, I'm totally happy to. Um, and just, yeah, have an amazing day. And I look forward to reaching out to you guys soon with more awesome videos. Talk to you later. Bye.